done uh, 400 kilometers, 250 miles, and um, yeah, that was a massive fight. Set off from um, where was from? Wellington. Wellington <laughs> at four o'clock this morning. It's now um, pretty much midnight. So um, yeah, well over 3,000 meters climbing, and for yeah, the first part of the day I had a bit of a stiff headwind. It, it was absolutely a beautiful day, dry and I mean, there's some stunning scenery, but seriously punchy. Uh, beautiful climbing over by the, what they call the desert road over um, to Taupo, Lake Taupo, but um, yeah, yeah, seriously tough going. I had a bit of a rubbish start this morning. Uh, coming out of Wellington, I was about two hours into the ride and I, um, I just didn't see a, a lip of tarmac in the dark, and um, the yeah the bike just skidded out, and I went skidding across the road. Uh, I'm fine. I <laughs> scuffed the bike and had to change the rear mech hanger. I cut my leg a bit, um, but I just got a bit of a fright more than anything else. I'm glad I was wearing mitts. But uh, second tumble of the trip, and uh, both happened early in the morning in the dark on slightly wet roads. But um, yeah, I think. Despite today being brutal, it means that we can hopefully make the flight. A head start for tomorrow. Yeah. Yeah. So what's left? Um, I think now it'll be 150 miles. 150 miles. Mm. So the plan is to get an early evening flight, and um, so I'll get about three hours sleep, um, three and a half maybe, no three. Back on the road at four, and. Um, Hopefully it's flatter again. Hopefully, hopefully it's flatter tomorrow. Yeah, you got a little more downhill start, and then. Uh, yeah. yeah. I mean, we were up over a thousand meters today at one point. Much less climbing. Massive. I feel like everyone was suffering today after yesterday. So. Yeah. yeah. All good. Good effort.